Hey guys, what up here, and welcome back to NASCAR Dirt Daytona Criminal Part Number 92. We're going to be doing a cup race at Atlanta and a truck race at Darlington. So, this will be the first part where we're going to be using a fully upgraded NASCAR Winston Cup Series car, and I'm excited to see how this will be as far as performance is concerned. It should be pretty <laughs> OP as of as of now. So, it's finally happened. It took me a season, uh, 30 races plus the four races in the season so far so about 33 34 some odd races so it finally happened so yeah let's uh, get in the qualifying here and see where we start it might be pull off turn four we'll see what this time is i think the pull was about a 29 8 so it's actually a bit faster than i was expecting from practice sessions and that's a 30.1 so a couple tenths off the pull so that's a little concerning but that's not bad, it's just when you only have one lap to qualify, when in real life, even by this point, when the game is made, you get two, so it's a little bit off, but the third place isn't bad, just it's going to be a concern once we um, do another season and then all the AI are fully like maxed out, then those lap times are really going to suffer, but... It's not a problem now. I'll deal with it later. So we'll see how this kind of goes. We just hope. I just hope we can kind of get off to a good start here. I did move the camera like a centimeter because I thought I wasn't center. So that's why I just thought I would bring it up because it, I know I know it moved and I know a ghost didn't do it. So I want to bring it up. So we got to an amazing start and we got the lead before we even got in turn one. And we have 11 laps in the fuel. I'm assuming a 23 lap race. I'm going to guess. Yep, I was right. So all right. Oof, almost hit. Marlin almost hit me, but we're good. So. I guess let's uh, pull away. There's a wreck in turn three. Okay. Will there be a caution for that, or are you just going to be saying things that don't exist? If, I, there's, if there's nothing in turn three, Cruci, we're going to have a problem, all right? We're going to have to, Bobby Labonte, we're going to have to fire you, because you're not making any sense. And there's nothing on, in the corner, so thanks for freaking me out for no good reason. Off turn two here, I will be pitting this lap. We have built a pretty good gap over Sterling Marlin, which is very important because I feel like I'm going to lose a lot of time down Piro no matter how I approach this. So I'm just going to try to slow down here. See comment section? I'm slowing down like when I'm in turn three. Oh my god, that's... That's going to be yellow, isn't it? That's going to be yellow, isn't it? God damn it, man. I can't win going down Piro. Uh... I, I can't, I honestly. This could be a funny compilation where I can just show me failing getting down pit road. And I think it could be like a feature length movie at this point. I'm, I I wish I could be exaggerating, but I, I can't. And getting down pit road, it wasn't even that bad. We didn't even have to, I mean, I had to repair damage, but it didn't seem like it affected the time at all. So that was good, surprisingly. Oh, you fucking son of a bitch game. Of course. Of course. I don't know if it's because of, of my incident or, or what, but that is fucking pristine, perfect timing game. But we're not lapped down. Surprisingly. So, alright. This, uh, I, I'm going to imagine everybody else is going to be pitting. Yes. Janked up. Hazy Atwood's lead. I was trying to slow up before I hit the line, and as soon as I tapped the damn brakes, the car just went freaking sideways. But, we're sixth. I don't know if we're going to be cycled out in that position, but we'll see. <laughs> what the? That was weird. <laughs> Why am I a lap ahead of everyone? Okay, I'm first again, alright. Thanks, game? <laughs> well, everything cycled out, but... I don't, I don't think that caution was for, for me with that incident before I went down the road. I mean, it couldn't have been, so I, I don't know. Was that caution for me or, or not? Um, hey, comment section. Do your thing down below. Carlo. Oh my god, Marlin. Okay, we're fine. Okay, we got a car length on him. He's been right there. Those left side tires are really worn. Now I was just thinking to myself now, since the car is upgraded and stuff, we don't have to worry about money anymore, so we can absolutely max out the pit crew so we can take four tires in every stop and really shouldn't lose time when we do it. That's the one thing I have not 
improved on it was the pick through so i should for sure do that because our left sides are cooked really bad and that's why marlin's still kind of right there behind me so this might be uh, a race where i kind of screw myself out of my own win because of that but i was trying to save money and i should have done that before or once i upgraded the car to the max but i didn't know if i had enough money to do it i guess that's what i guess that's why i didn't do it as soon as possible yeah, we're just hanging on, just barely quicker than him in the straightaways, and in the corners he is closing in on me, but as long as I kind of, you know, stick to the bottom, I think he won't be able to get by me, so we'll just see how this all plays out. Carlo. Oh my god, there he goes. Son of a... I just I couldn't turn anymore. It just kind of got underneath me. Oh, lap traffic, though. That's going to play a factor. Oh my god, that actually helped me. In the grass. <laughs> Back to the lead. Holy shit, that was pretty badass. I'll give myself that. Lap down car, where are you gonna go? All right, just be in my way. Or we'll just turn him. Okay, oh, 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 oh. Okay, he saved it. I'm not gonna wreck Marlin again like Rocky. I'm not gonna do that, okay? Just gonna keep it to the bottom. This lap down car is gonna probably be in the way, so that's gonna, that's gonna screw me. Turn, car, turn. <laughs> oh my God, it almost hit the wall. Oh, like he got, he's got to get caught in lap traffic like perfectly for me to have a chance back at him. John Wood, John oh Wood, you son of a bitch, you, oh, you ass! I just fucking turned. Ah, oh, damn it, man! I just I was trying to stay to the inside. Maybe I could have got a good run through the corner. And Marlon's gonna win. I guess that's redemption from. <laughs> Uh, Rockingham, I guess. The car, the left sides were way too worn. You can see it. It's, it's It was bad. I, <laughs> God damn it. That was one hell of a finish. I'll, I'll get, but my streak ends. Oh, that's, that's what I'm going to do next. I'm going to for sure improve the pit crew so we can take four tire stops and not have a problem with that anymore. And after that race, we get 236000 so a pretty good race earnings and 11000 for repair fees, so that's a little bit. So, yeah. Um, yeah, we have an 83-point lead over Marlin, I think, who's still in second, even though we kind of screwed him out of Rockingham. So, I don't know, but yeah, season's looking good for us so far. I mean, it's going to probably be just a domination station sort of season. I think we have everything on there except for one part so we might go with uh, LeVay's fur uh, furniture for 25,000 so instead of it being 10,000 it will be 18,000 so that's that's better 15,000 yeah it's that's that's really the best we can go with for that uh, uh, range so we'll put that in there and I think that's it for all the sponsors so we're gonna go straight to employees and we're gonna go Oh yeah, this is for everything in general. I kind of forgot about this. So, chassis builder, we're gonna get the best one we have, or best one possible. And I guess it's wait, no, we did we get chassis? Okay. Oh, we did get everything we needed for the uh, engine tuner and chassis builder. We just need a better pit crew. Okay. So, we'll go with the best so 33,000 race that should make everything a lot better so yeah so I think we got everything we need for uh, all this stuff I haven't checked this in a long time so I'm assuming this is all pretty much maxed out and it, and it looks like it is so okay now we got everything pretty much picture perfect so let's go into the truck race in Darlington I don't think much will happen so it's gonna be a chill race no face cam, so I guess it'll be easier for me to edit and render, because if you have face cam, it takes longer to render that than, than a non-one, so yay, but nothing will happen. I, I'm sure nothing will happen. So you can tune off now. I can tell by the analytics. I can tell. You guys are clever. Off turn four, we'll see what this time is. It should be, if not a pull lap, then an easy top five, I'm guessing. But yeah, that, I mean, that seemed like a good time, I think. We'll just have to see here. And we're on top of the charts for now. And Nordic is in second. Lester is now second. <laughs> and, okay, I thought it was all done, but it's not. And we got it by, okay, it's still going. Is it done? Or Okay, it's done. And we got the pulls, so 
We'll see what we do off the start here. I'm, I'm kind of banking on probably pulling away here and then we'll chill. Welcome so, to NASCAR's oldest super let's see, that comes to fruition uh, or whatever that word is. Because my AI truck driver almost ran in the back of, almost turned in front of Presley there. That was weird. But yeah, we got to a really good start. And we have a car length or a truck length over Lester, so we'll pull away until I pit around lap seven or so. I'll be hitting down here with this lap. This will be the first time I'll try to do a uh, full four tire uh, you know, stop, so we'll see how this all kind of plays out. A little bit shaky down Piro, but it wasn't anything too bad. I think we're a bl very below speed, but we're going to put in just enough fuel, four tires, and we'll be in and out, and I'm hoping that the pit stop is not like 20 seconds or something. God, 10 seconds, <laughs> oh my God, 10 seconds for that, that's disgusting. And these are a bunch of trucks that I believe are gonna be, uh, huh. Now I'm kinda curious where I'll cycle out because I might not be leading, I don't know. I should be, I mean, I have like a three second lead, so. I'm going to think so, but yeah, it's weird that they, I got into pit road so far ahead of them and then they got the same time as me, like how, did, did, did they really just take two tires? I don't know. Okay, so I guess all the green flag pit stops are done and yeah, we're in third. We actually lost time down pit road, that's insane. So I, I guess that kind of debunks the theory if they were going down Maybe of them when they go down here, they just take, you know, two tires. I mean, it could be. It's like the only thing I could think of that they gained that much ground. Unless I just went down through that damn bad again. I don't know. I, I, I like to think once in a while I can get down through it okay. But I, I, it's hard. It's a hard pill to swallow. I lost like three seconds of time and I heard a record turn for it. So we'll see if the crew chief's actually lying this time or telling the truth. You never know with him sometimes. He likes to play games on me when, when he knows I do well in these races. So. Three wide for the lead. This should be a very doable pass. Especially, well, maybe not for Darlington standards, but kind of made it work. And to the bottom, and clear. clear yeah. Hey, you're, you're right. You're, I was clear high, but there was no wreck and turn for this. So I don't know what you're talking about. Unless you're meaning about this truck right up in front of me that's really slow. I mean, it could be what he's referring to, but I don't think it's going to be too much of a problem. So, yeah. yeah. I guess we'll just pull away. Mike Flag's out. Still just cruising around the track. Have a pretty gargantuan lead over second. About two point back to where it was before. We'll just bump into more lap down traffic. For, for no good reason. And we'll bring it home with uh, another win. I don't think too much happened, so... Makes me feel glad I didn't include the pace cam. So I guess there's that. So high lane in three and four. This lap down truck gives me room. Thank you. And we'll rack up another win for our final truck series season. So, the swan song for the truck series season continues. I don't know what that really means, but we won. After that race, we get 160,000, so another good uh, bonus, I would say. So, yeah. It's looking good. I'm kind of curious how much money I'm going to end up having by the end of this uh, Let's Play. Like, is it going to be over like 100 million or something like crazy? And we're second in the standings. What happened? That was our first win of the year. Oh yeah, that's right. John Wood won at Daytona. Because the, the pit strategy kind of messed me up a bit under the green flag conditions and shit. So I think I got like fourth or something. I don't know. But yeah, it, that good part. Everything went smoothly. So we finally got a caution free race in there somewhere. And we get to improve the sponsors. So and I could. I mean, I might as well try to do that. So... We'll put this one there. Actually, no, that's actually gonna, that's gonna mess it up a lot. So we'll keep nearly's on there. And I don't know which one will be the best. Uh, Fifteen thousand. Yeah, okay. That really didn't change anything. Uh, but that didn't change anything either. Okay. Well, I guess we'll keep everything the same because nothing else is gonna be better. So, yeah. Everything went good in this part, I would say, for the most part. 
Big shout out to my tier 3 Patreon supporters, the Dell Reynolds, Weather Bros, Kamikaze Games, Ryan Lazar, and Day 500 Champ 15, Jeff Gordon, Zach Rogers, Racing News Now, Alan Gray, Matthew Murray, Stephen Willie, Simrius Jazz One, and Irishman GFS for a donation again. I can't say enough how much I appreciate each and every single one of you for your support to the channel. It does mean a lot to me, and I can't thank you guys' help along the way with everything. I'll see you all in part 94, I guess, for uh, two cup races, which I think is going to be at Bristol and Martinsville? Or Darlington and Martinsville, maybe. That could be, yeah. Okay, Darlington and Bristol, so that should be two wild races for for ourselves. Maybe at least for Bristol. At least for Bristol. Darlington might not be so much. We'll see. Uh, I'll, I'll catch you all in the next part, and I'll see you all later, and as always, have a good day, everyone.